I got time to kill. I'm driving back from Topeka. Just got into a heated debate with Jackie. Started talking about life and stuff with baby boy Blip. And I don't think she liked my answers for things. Uh, we started talking about living situations and stuff. That stuff is completely moot points at this point in time. But we, we had a discussion up on that earlier. And we were watching a movie. We were watching Scream. And uh, out of nowhere, she pauses it and says that something that I said earlier made her upset. And I said, what? And she, told, she said that she was upset because... I was I would not offer to give her full residence of baby blip or well she didn't like that I didn't like not not having residence I uh, one of the one of the parts of the conversations that we had was that I told her that I would not just give up residency well she didn't like that idea and then fast forward to a couple of hours we were watching the movie and she pauses it and says well that stuck with me and I explained myself I'm like hey you know I'm, I'm not giving up that residency like that's that's important to me and she was trying to explain to me how she's not worried about it later on that's something that we'll discuss and blah 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 and every single time she makes it sound like wherever she was is where the baby was going to be predominantly and I made it very clear that that's just because that's what she wants doesn't mean that that's what she's going to get and that upset her a lot and apparently because she's emotional and hormonal I guess I'm supposed to bend to her every whim and do whatever I have to to make her happy and that's not my role my role is to look out for what is best for baby blip and myself and my kids and my family and me giving up residency at some point is not something that I really want to do well apparently she took that really bad and decided she wasn't going to finish the movie, that she was just going to go lay down and go to bed. So I went and I asked her, I was like, hey, do you want me to leave? And she says, yeah, that probably would be for the best. Okay, well, it's 11.45 at night. Um, here, what is today? Today is the 19th. There we go. And so I'm like, okay, well, I'll get in my truck and I'll go back home. And I think what set her off was we had finished the conversation and as soon as we finished the conversation, she pressed play on the TV. I grabbed my phone because I was having a conversation with people about cats, a black cat and walking down a catwalk. And I think that she perceived me messaging up, uh, my group chat about the catwalk, I think put her over the edge. And I would have explained it to her that I was talking about this, but I think that she interpreted it wrong and thought that, I don't know, that I was doing something malicious. I don't know. So, to keep the peace, I left. So now I'm driving and I have a two-hour or whatever drive back home. This sucks. You know... It, What's messed up is I'm doing everything I can as best as I can for everyone. And I guess that's my mistake because I'm trying to solve everyone's problems and fix everything. And I shouldn't be. I should just be making my life livable and taking care of my
my kids. And as much as I want to take care of Jackie and the girls and all that, I don't think that that's conducive to my happiness, which sucks. But I think it's what I'm going to have to do. And I... I don't know. It seems... It seems ridiculous to have these kind of arguments. But, you know... In this day and age, just because a woman has the baby... Does not mean that she is superior to the father. And it bugs me because... With as progressive as Jackie wants to be, and and says she is, it boggles my mind that she would think that, well, just because she had the baby, she has more rights. That bugs me. And where is it written that just because a woman physically has a baby that she is automatically given primary custody of the baby. I don't know. It's It bugs me. I guess she just assumed that I would just let her do whatever. And, th- and that's what bugs me. Is she gets mad at me. Because I don't agree with her on things. And she can get super heated and be very adamant about things. And it's okay, but I can't. I have to adjust. I have to uh, give her grace, as she says, because she's pregnant. Well, no. No, pregnancy is not a justification for being narcissistic. And how someone can say that Oh, well, I believe this, 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 this. And I say, okay, well, I believe that, 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 that. Oh, well, you can't tell me that because that just, uh, that hurts my emotions. And I'm, uh, my hormones are out, out of balance. And you can't tell me that that's just rude. That's just mean. Well, no, I am responding to what you say. Why, why is it that a, a father would have to bend to the whim of a pregnant woman? A pregnant mother, I should say. That's not right. And then me get in trouble because I believe differently. That's, that's not the way of the world. I don't know. You know, I... I'm so tired of trying to fix everything and make everything work. I, this There is literally no positive outcome that I can do. <laughs>
primary residential custody of baby Blip, then I'm an asshole. If I don't fight, I'm an asshole because he's not worth it. Or I could just give her what she wants, and that is her have residential primary, and I get my occasional weekend. That's not okay with me. Jackie's getting hurt. And I don't want either. Should have thought about that before having sex when we lived two hours apart. pisses me off that she can start an argument and ask me my opinion and then get mad at my opinion and tell me I'm being narcissistic. How does that make sense? If I ask somebody their thoughts and opinions on something and they tell me that's what I asked for, that's what I wanted, it's not about turning things on, it's turning the spotlight on me, it's saying my side. And everybody's like, oh, well, make sure you say how you feel. Well, I said what I thought and I said how I felt and I wasn't being mean about it but I don't beat around the bush I don't edge around it I tell it straight and I don't mean it to sound like a jerk but if somebody asks me a direct question I'd like to try to give them a direct answer This is going to end very, very ugly. And there's nothing I can do to stop it. I don't know what to do. I don't know what I was thinking. I don't know what I was thinking of trying to solve the world's problems. That, that is my biggest problem, is I try to solve everyone's problem. If I would just sit back, relax, and just go with the flow and worry about my household only, then I would be okay. But no. Because I'm concerned for her, her daughters, 
their well all well being I'm a jerk You know, I don't want much. I just want a calm life with my kids. I don't think that that's too much to ask. But I don't think that I'm going to get that. Time to think about it. Maybe I'll make another video. We'll see. 